Phillips Fix. Uh, if you want to email me, you can email me at paulphillipsfix at gmail.com. That's paulphillipsfix at gmail.com. Today we got my friend's uh, 2000 Pontiac Sunfire up in the air. Uh, he had his rack and pinion crack and he tack welded it and it stopped the leak. A friend of his had recommended that he throw a part in from a used car he had, a junked car. He said the rack was in terrific shape, but uh, that was not the true story. And my friend Frank learned a lesson. Do not put used parts on your car. It cost you twice of what it would have cost you and extra work. I'm gonna take a look down here. He had a whole load of power steering fluid. Get inside, you're gonna wiggle it. He had a whole load of power steering fluid leak all over the place. Ate up his CV joint boots, which caused the CV joints to go. And deteriorated a bunch of other rubber and he's got EVAP issues now. If you look, we're leaking at the top of the uh, seal on the rack. I don't know if you can hear that. He's wiggling the steering a little bit. The slop in that rack. So he's gonna have to get a uh, new rack for this car. So, lesson learned on that one. Cheap is expensive. You got a part that goes, get a quality part. Don't buy some uh, no-name crap off of eBay or uh, throw junkyard stuff in, unless it's like a computer or something. But that's it for that, pal. We gotta get a uh, new rack. Have a good one, guys. Please give a like and, like and subscribe, and hopefully I can bring some useless information to you guys. Feel free to comment and uh, contact me at paulphillipsfix at gmail.com. Take care, guys. Bye-bye.